Hello friends, welcome back. It is the first official day of winter break. Right girls? Yep. Are you very excited? Huh? No. No? Do you yeah. have my friends can't play? <laughs> this also begins the time for your families to go on vacations. Can or can't play as long as I don't have school. Good attitude, Chels. A lot of the friends have either gone on vacation or they're off at family's Hawaii. houses for the, oh man, don't tell me that. <laughs> I was just talking about Hawaii to, with, with our friends, the other Browns. Our goal is to own in Hawaii. But anyway, we it is late. It's 2 o'clock in the afternoon. But we have a clean house, correct? Is your room clean? Yeah. Look at your cute outfit. But that's the whole goal is to make sure that the house is clean for Christmas Day so we can enjoy our day. And we have a fun thing coming up. Normally, that we're doing right after Christmas as well. Normally oh, Ashley, are you going to come home and color? Yeah. Oh, I. She's been nuzzled by the fire after she got her chores done. She's been working on her little coloring book she got from her secret sister. Should I show one of the pages? Um, her favorite one. That is her favorite one that she has done. Yep. Yeah. So, she's had a fun time coloring. Nope, doesn't go here. You can put it over there. We are going to go shopping. Okay. Abby has secret sister gifts to get. For you me. guys are done, right? Yeah. So Abby has to sneak off. We also have to get a new pan. And I think, Ashley, are we ready to tell the story? <laughs> sure, I'll <don't> hear <laughs> Okay, we'll get in the car and we'll tell it in a minute, okay? <laughs> go brush your hair real fast. I already did. It. Uh, it doesn't look. I did, I did it when you were like. And then you did something. Can you go brush it again? <laughs> This is why it's two o'clock and we're just barely leaving the house. <laughs> I turned the camera on right when you did that. Perfect timing, yes. Okay, so what are you guys doing? I don't know oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I can't do it. Can I say the name? Hmm? I don't think you can say the name. Okay. Um, You're gonna give it to her before she sees this, hopefully. Um, They're getting friend gifts. Yeah. Right? Three. How we have three I friends. Get, get these two. For okay. That. And we just need. Do we need three presents or two? Three. I thought we just need two. Okay, we've decided on three. Nod for Chelsea. Three friends. Ashley, do you agree on this? Because they're your friends too. Well, you agree never, on these? Well, do I have to pay for it? <laughs> yes, you have to pay for it. Pay for we pay, you pay for a part of it. Okay, it's pouring rain. <laughs> so it's hard to like get back to the car. We all have secret sister and secret friend gifts. We actually had your friend run into us at the Yeah, store. she picked me up. Yeah, I was trying to keep them away from Abby because yeah. Abby just got her her present. Yeah. That's so all. I go like this, and then it, I, my eyes just adjust it. And then I'm her friend. Her over it. Yeah. You guys all can't talk at okay. the same time. I know. I'm so crazy. they were kind of scuttling away from Abby, and their friend, I saw her friend running up, and she's like, shh. And so her friend lifted Abby, right, or Ashley, right off the ground and <laughs> surprised her. But then we had to hide those gifts, because one of them was for her. Anyway, so Ashley, are we is it time to tell your story? You can tell them. Okay. I just told Abby about this this morning. <laughs> <laughs> Can you believe she did this? I mean, it's, it's she took it, what you said literally. literally. Okay, so you know we made the Jello molds the other day, and she was she was determined to do it herself with my help from the well, couch. You were yours on the couch. I know, <laughs> but there was a portion of it that you could do by yourself. So she needed to boil two cups of water, and then I needed her to get two cups of cold water ready. So it was a little bit of a struggle for her to find the measuring cup, measure out two cups, and then she had to learn how to turn the oven on and get the right pan stove. put on, yeah, turn the stove on and get the right pan to put the water in. And then she did that and I could hear the little gas click and I could hear it go on or whatever. And I was like, okay, put your water in the pan. And she's like, okay. And I said, now take that same measuring cup and measure out two <laughs> cups of cold water and leave it on the counter for when we get the boiled water and the jello mixed and then we'll add the cold water. And she's like, well, I can't do that until the boiled water is done. And I was like, no, you can't, it's fine. We went back and forth like three times and she was insistent that she couldn't do the cold water until the, the water was done boiling. And I was like, why are you worried about when the water is boiling? And she's like, cause the cup is in the pan. <laughs> she put the literally put the measuring cup <laughs> in the pan with the water in it. Because it was ever, oh. I don't know. She put, yeah, she, she put the water in the pan. So it melted a plastic measuring cup 
to my pan, my <laughs> super good heavy duty pan. Target does not have a replacement. This is the second time I've looked and I have to go to, up to Marshall's now because we have to bake like fudge and candy and <laughs> I can't do it now because I don't have a pan. And you're gonna have this story told until you're in high school. And then when you have your own kids, you can teach them how to not put the plastic She's cup in the pan. For not to, like, I know. Like, the the That's plastic. the thing is we've, we've made like boiled water before. She knows how to measure yeah, water I know, out. But I don't know why I was thinking that. I have no idea either. So off to go get a pan. just took Abby to a new babysitting job and I hope it's a good fit with this family. I really do think it's going to. I just feel bad because I get her kind of hooked with these families that are super sweet and she becomes their regular and then they move and this family they're staying with her or staying in her parents house while her parents serve a mission for our church and I'm sure within the year they're gonna have to move out as soon as the parents get home and so it's like I get her all hooked with these super cute families to be their babysitter and that's what this mom wanted she's like I need my babysitter I need it to be like a routine person that I can text and say hey I want to go out tonight I've had it can you come over and I was like that's Abby that's you know exactly what she'll do so I hope it goes well for her tonight it's just a couple hours there's a musical performance tonight at our church um, but so many people are going to be going to it so there's not really much of a chance of us being able to get a seat and so we are going to go for just game night at our friend's house Jason and I will but you guys despite the fact that we just went and got ICs and yum, now yum. that I've drank half of it and we have to go down all these turkeys. I know, we're on a, 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 like a quarter left. We're at the very tippy top of a mountain here. We, we live in the woods and we took her to the very top of this mountain. And now we're winding down. They're like, oh, that wasn't a good choice. <laughs> Twisty roads and all. Um, but I should have thought about the icy a little bit. I didn't know what time it was. And now we're hungry for dinner, but they're kind of full and a little. I'm not. Luffy on the I, street corner. I still have some. I think I'm gonna take him to a drop-in, and I might be like kicking myself later. But Jason's not home from work for another two hours, and I'm hungry, and I don't want to go home and cook because these guys won't eat what I cook, and Ashley will only eat a sandwich if she goes home. Am I correct? Yep. Anyway, I'm up in my old neighborhood now. Now that we've come down off the mountain halfway and but I can't show you that house I can't show you the house that well when did we move into it Kaylee was one and we moved out when Abby was one but I can't show it to you because Jason's brother owns it and they have it rented out so I can't even show it to you because they still could technically move back into it we want to keep that private so it's a really Where cute house it? it's a rambler and it's a completely remodeled house but yeah. it's coming up we're coming up on it right now so, wish me luck going to Red Robin. It's been, oh, there's a peace sign. Hang on. There's a peace sign. That's cute. All right, so my initial plan today when we, we headed out was to actually go to the mall after we dropped Abby off at this babysitting job. But then I remembered we are a week before Christmas and I still remember when I worked at the mall. This was like, I don't even know, seven years ago. I don't even know how no, long ago. You were little when I quit. Yeah, I have all the stuff that you still got. Yeah, she still has the Jimbery stuff yeah, I had. I worked at Jimbery at the mall. One, for a very small paycheck, and two, for um, the discount on the clothes, because it was phenomenal. But I worked there, and one of the last, the last Christmas season that I worked there was horrific. I think it took me, we're only 30 minutes from the mall, but it took me two hours to get from home to the mall and up the parking garage and I was so I was a, an hour late for work well at that point I was an hour late from work for work and then um, I ran out of gas in Jason's like electric car 
And so I had to like coast down in battery and keep using my brakes so that I could keep charging my brake. And it was awful. I was so scared I was gonna run out of gas like going downhill through the parking garage because I couldn't find a parking spot. There was nothing available. So I had to just get out of the parking garage to go and get gas to come back into the parking garage. It was awful. And I was talking to my manager like the whole time. I was like, this is not worth it. Like it's now been, I think it was a total of three hours for me to try and get in. But she was like, dude, we're gonna be here till midnight. So I don't care when you get here, you need to get here. And we did, we worked until midnight with the store open and I was like, after that, I was like, I'm out. I'm not doing this anymore. And that was the last holiday season I worked. Um, I don't remember what month that was that I quit, but I did not work another holiday season. It was awful. And so I'm like, why would I want to go down to the mall just for fun the week before Christmas when I know how much it, it was difficult when I worked there. So that's why we are not going to the mall. Okay, eat burgers every meal or eat pizza every meal? Burgers every meal or pizza every meal? Yeah. Burgers. burgers. You say burgers? Pizza. Well, I don't like pizza. I don't know. I don't like anything, burgers are. Actual food. <laughs> oh, did the crust of the pizza? I guess burgers. I eat the bread from the burger. But the burger, you could have like different kinds of burger every time. Yeah. yeah. So that would be okay. Pizza. Well, yeah, that's true. Okay. okay no. really One more. Okay. Be a basketball star or be a football star? Oh. Be, be a, a basketball star or what? Or a football star. Uh, basketball is less dangerous. Basketball. Yeah. Basketball. basketball or football star. I don't want you to die, basketball. so yeah. yeah. Well, and plus, I don't like. You like basketball. Because you're doing that for TV. Uh huh. So it's kind of annoying. Because once when we were doing it, it got stuck right between the hoop and like. You know, oh, it did? So we had uh, the teacher was like, get yeah, another basketball, and just like hit it, and it bounced back. And oh. It, and it went in. We're like, does that count? Because it technically didn't hit the floor. And they're like, yeah, it does. Yeah. I already know what mom's gonna Okay, do. what is the next one? Okay. The balls live in, in the, Live in the mountains. Or live at the beach. Oh, we'll live at the beach. Mountains. Do we not know me? In fact, I was just looking at real estate in Maui today. It is very far outside of my budget. Very, very far. Okay, so that is the normal salad bowl and you get for refills, kids. right? For kids. for kids. Yeah, for the kid menu. Look what they brought her. <laughs> Look at this salad. It's like full on. She just took off the croutons. Oh, like that's a good salad. And she eats it that way every time. <laughs> It's no not, pork. It's not even a who put cheese every on salad? Who puts cheese on salad? Cheese on salad's really good. If you just did it like normal, it would taste good. Okay, we are back at home. I have my pan. Just need to wash it before I use it first. Not exactly what I wanted, but they don't really make what I actually want. Anyway, I think maybe I'll ask my dad to get it at a specialty store that he has near him because they just don't make them like we need them. But we also got a bag of ice because our ice maker is broken. We're waiting on the filters. Oh, I think we turned it off. But we think it's all like frozen up. So I'm actually going to just fill this whole container with ice. And then we're going to wrap you guys' presents really fast. Okay. All right, the girls helped me wrap their presents. And I did the first one really cute. <laughs> We wrapped the actual present inside, then we wrapped it in cellophane and added some kisses and some chocolates. And I had these cellophane bags that I ordered on Amazon for some other gifts that I'm gonna do later on for the kids, but I can't do them now because then they'll see them. But the bags were huge. So I only did it on this one and that one, but I accidentally cut the bottom off on that one instead of the top. <laughs> so then we got to this one and I didn't wanna waste another one and make a mistake, so we just wrapped that one. But you did a good job helping me. No. It was, I know, they won't know. All right, I think that's all for tonight. We are going to get these two kiddos into pajamas and ready for bed. Not in bed. She's looking, she's giving me a look. She's going to color. She's over here by the fire again. Are you having fun? Yeah, I'm just figuring out what color to do. Okay. 
So she's gonna call her, it's literally only like 5.15. <laughs> so they have plenty of time before bedtime. I need to edit this video really quick before I go to game night. I'm a little behind on videos, I'm not gonna lie. But then Jason and I are gonna leave as soon as he gets home. So we're gonna say goodnight to you. We had a fun day with the girls. How many days till Christmas? Okay, you wanna check? Is our house getting One, two, full? Three, four, five, six, seven. Well, look, our house is getting pretty full. What day are we on over here? Uh, 18. We're on number 18, so you can put 19 in tomorrow. Do you like this house better? Yeah. But, you but can't that really one has chocolates in it, right? You can't really see the five. That's okay. We, can, we get the idea, right? But so we have a couple more days left. This is how you count how many days are left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll see you guys next time. Take care. Happy holidays. For you guys, it's just days away from Christmas. So I hope you have a good holiday. Take care, good night.